There may be times when you are playing Roblox where you want to change something about your avatar. Maybe you want to change your shirt or your pants or your hair. By the end of this video, you'll be able to customize your Roblox avatar. Let's get started. So if you are either playing Roblox games or creating Roblox games, I have Roblox Studio open here and you notice that I can test play this game. And so I'll hit the play button and you'll see my Roblox avatar spawn into the game. And so this is what I look like right now. Now let's say I want to change something about my avatar. What I need to do is go to roblox.com and when you go to roblox.com you want to sign into your account. And so you can see uh, I'm signed into my account here on the top right. So once you're signed in you want to find the avatar editor. And so in order to do that you want to click on this drop down on the left and you see it's got different options here. So I'm going to click on avatar. So I clicked on that drop down. I clicked on avatar. And now this brings me to the avatar editor. And so now this is the place where I can change different elements of my avatar. So in order to change uh, my shirt, for instance, I went ahead and got another shirt here, the blue and black motorcycle shirt. And so I'm going to just going to click that. So let me show it to you. So I'm just going to click this uh, shirt and you see it changed on my avatar. So now my avatar is wearing that shirt. And so that's uh, the easiest way to change the avatar. So once you do that, your avatar will have that shirt on. So whichever things have the check mark on the top, that's what your avatar is currently wearing. So in order to test that, I'm just gonna go back to Roblox Studio, go ahead and play. And now I should have that black shirt on instead of the blue one. Yep, so there you can see my avatar now has a black shirt on. And this will work whether you're playing your own games you create or the games online. And one thing I want to point out is that, so you can notice that there's only certain options here. There's, there's not too much in my inventory. So in order to have access to other clothes, you can go to the avatar shop. You can click here in the get more or just go on the top here where it says avatar shop. And once I click to the avatar shop, then you'll see all the different things that are available to you to change. And so I'm actually going to go down to the clothing. That's uh, the first place I want to start. And so I can do shirts, t-shirts, pants, or all. Um, let's go to pants. And so once you click on pants, you're going to notice that uh, there are many pant options available to you. And so you'll notice that uh, some of the pants have free underneath and then some of them have a number and that's the cost of the Robux. So some of them you will have to pay Robux for and other ones will be free. Uh, let's go ahead and see this one here, the uh, scrubs pants. I'm going to try that one. It's free. So you just click on it, an item that you would like. And then in order to add that to your avatar editor, you would just press on get. And then it would ask you, you want to make sure you want to purchase this. And this one's free. So since it's free, I don't have to have any Robux in my account. I can go ahead and press get now. Again, if it's free, you don't have to have any Robux. Now that I have this, it says that it is available in my inventory. So again, to double check that, I will go over to the th drop down over here, click on avatar. And then I can see uh, in the avatar editor, there they are. There's those industry baby scrub pants. So now I'm going to click that. And now I can change to those uh, pants on my avatar. So again, I'm going to go to my Roblox studio and go ahead and play the game. And you'll notice I've got those bright pink pants on. So this is how you can customize your avatar before you enter games that you are playing or creating in Roblox. So you now know how to customize your avatar in Roblox. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other Roblox studio tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you and I'll see you in the next video.